Hi, this is Alan from Control4 Australia talking to you today about Control Force integration to the open source XBMC Media Center. For those of you who are unfamiliar with XBMC, XBMC is a cross platform media center available on Windows, Linux, Macintosh, original Xbox, and Apple TV. We here at Control4 Australia have integrated XBMC to interface to all your user interfaces. This includes touchscreens, Zigbee remote controls, and Zigbee keypads. First of all, let's go through our on-screen interface. As you can see, we can choose any movie on demand via our video menu. Control 4 will send a command through to XBMC to play a file we have selected and switch our AV equipment over to the correct input. Control 4 communicates to XBMC via XBMC's web-based interface. We can skip forward, back, we can press pause, and by pressing pause, Control 4 will turn the lights on, and by pressing play, Control 4 will dim the lights. Let's move on to our touchscreen interface. As you can see, the touchscreen interface is very similar to the on-screen interface we just saw. Let's click on the videos and browse through some subcategories and select a movie. Yet again, all the transport protocols are handled through Control 4's IP interface to XBMC. From fast forwarding, playing, pausing, or stopping the media. Let's move on to our, this SR250 Sysmo remote. With the SR250, we can utilize the remote's OLED display to yet again select any movie we want. We can browse by all categories, genres, directors, actors, ratings. Let's select all. We select our Dark Knight movie. And Control 4 sends a command to play the movie. Yet again, play, pause, and stop will bring the lights up and down. I hope this has given you an insight into Control Force media player integration capabilities, and I'll see you guys in my next video.